welcome to Pen and Net TV. Our mission is to promote local NGOs, charity events, community services and corporate social responsibility practice in companies. We sincerely invite individual or company to support a non-profit video documentaries by sponsoring the production cost. With your generous support, we will continue to bring you the passion, virtuous and warm-hearted stories of true panel guides. Okay, it is my privilege to introduce myself. By the way, I'm Pastor Geoffrey, and it is a joy to let you know what we are doing in Jelutong area. And we have an event on the fourth Sunday of every month, whereby we invite, especially the poor people, to come to our place, third floor, Wisma Jelutong. And basically, our program start at 5:30 to 6:30. That one hour is. We are giving community services. We have two doctors to give a general check up, and then we have about three to four hair stylists to give a free haircut. And with that one hour community service that we rendered at 6:30 to 7:15, we also have a dinner time whereby we give them a free dinner and some dessert for them to eat. And we find that even though we live right. Close to the city center, we do find there are some very very poor people who do not enjoy the privilege of good food. So we give them a nice dinner from 6:30 to 7:15, and with that we also invite them to the fourth floor where we have a celebration and we have singing songs and also celebrate their birthday. And we bring them a message of hope, of love that there is meaning to live in in this world. And then with that we close and we bless them. And as we close this event, we call it big party. They will take a gift pack back home. The reason why we call it a big party because we find that in this world there's so many sorrows, there's so many sad story, and we find it maybe a bit meaningful or make a little bit of difference to these poor people, inviting them to come. To celebrate, to have a time of joy and fun, and to sing together with us, and we also take opportunity in this big party of ours, which we have it every month on the fourth Sunday. We also celebrate some festival occasion, like for example today we celebrate Mother's Day. Though it is on the second Sunday of May, we take the opportunity to celebrate in our big party, and for this big party celebrating a Mother's Day or something extra, we. Have our usual program where they come in for community service help, and then the dinner, and then they're invited to our fourth floor where we celebrate their birthday. And the special event extra we give it to them is we give them an armful of ten dollars, basically to appreciate mothers. Mothers are the greatest human being in this world who sacrifice their love and will not truly publicly recognize. So we felt that an armful. To tell them that you're doing a good job, good job to your family and to the society, and also the church uh, people have donated uh, dresses, and we also want to take this opportunity to ask them to choose two dresses that they like, and it is all free of charge, and these dresses are in good condition. With the gift of the amount ten dollars and the dresses, they also take back the normal gift back that they uh, which we provide, and so next month. Will be June and、uh, June is a month of Father's Day on the third Sunday. The whole world is celebrating Father's Day, and so in our big party on the fourth Sunday of June, we will remember the fathers, and we will bring a very special event of、uh, hope and care and joy to tell them, fathers, we you know your heart ache as men. You need to bring bread into the home. You have your personal conflict and challenges in the working place, and. We want to、uh, bring some joy and encouragement to the men in June. Open up to the community, and the、uh, community service that we are doing right now is haircut, free haircut. So these are the people that they come here to give them a free haircut, and and this will be done by our member who will be、uh, doing the haircut. And、uh, Jason is one who is doing it, and、uh, he's a teacher, but he has been cutting hair for. 
for some people lah. So he offered himself, and then uh, he is one of our church member friend who not able to make it. So he willing to volunteer himself to come to have our hair, to give haircut to the people, and then uh, so this is our church member, and she's a professional hairstylist, and so this is a daughter, uh, and the worker who's doing the free haircut for the bit. They are all done free. Uh, once a month, fourth Sunday of month, each month uh, we provide this. Uh, mm. I move over this section, we have uh, these community people, they are actually coming for a general health check. And so right inside here we have two doctors. It is Dr. Shireen and uh, giving community service. And then we also have another doctor, Dr. Chai Hui, uh, giving attending to a uh, patient. Okay, right inside the gift pack, they will be taken home and there will be vitamin C and then what is the orange thing? Vitamin B complex and vitamin C. Okay, B complex and vitamin C. And then there is a brochure about diet, healthy living. So we have many, many people coming and all these people are around the area here. And some of them are extremely, extremely uh, poor family. Yeah. And all these community services that we have, we have it every month on the fourth Sunday, 5.30 to 6.31 one hour. Um, and then they will register the name, you know, and then at the celebration, when they go back, we like to give them a gift, you know, just to tell them that we care for you, you are welcome. And all these are church members from different professions, they are businessmen, reminds you of whatever they are doing, but they give their time, you know, to serve the people for Sunday once a month. We'll start our singing, and so this is a singing to let them rejoice to come. And all these are our church members. And so all these people come, they come and sing, and then then we have a prayer to bless them and after that they will have their food at 6 30 to 7 15 and after that they go up for a celebration yeah thank you at 6 30 our dinner will begin so let me take you to the dinner food section that we have and uh, all these food are serving free to the community people. So these are the dessert and all these is our church member who volunteer themselves. They are from various professions, but they take their time, you know, from uh, young to old, old to young, all different types. And this is the dessert. And so these are the food that we give it to the people who come. Uh, fish, eggs and veg. And these are all church members who comes and we have this guy who got touched by the community and then he started to come to church and now he's involved to serve the people yeah these are all the people and uh, volunteers have been very faithful church members different professions some already retired but still serving you know uh, and he's sweating here to serve and uh, these are young people who also get the vision yeah say hi they are all in the tv net yeah the picture of the year. Ah. Alright, and of course, uh, of the whole year event, our biggest event, okay, we take the opportunity also to celebrate our Christmas and normally we do it two nights. Again, we have free dinner and uh, we have a crowd, about 300 people will come each night. And uh, uh, so, uh, being doing this little contribution to the community, to the charity, we encounter some very heartbreaking needs like uh, people that do not have enough to eat, 
and some do not have money even to see doctor and some do not have a proper place to stay and with what we are doing we have a plan and we have a burden in our hearts that we will extend our facilities and we are looking in the possibility of purchasing a land whereby we can build facilities like maybe an old folks home to house them beside our monthly event and also we also look into the education need and the uh, students many of the students are having problem in school and not doing well in school we hope we can provide that also to the young people we hope this community service were able to provide three generational uh, age for the children for the teenagers and also for the elderly people thank you